What is etiquette? Etiquette is a set of conventional rules of personal behavior in polite society, usually in the form of an ethical code that delineates the expected and accepted social behaviors that occurred with the conventions and norms observed by a society, a social class, or a social group. In practical speaking, gym etiquette is none other than respect. That's right, respect. Respect for the equipment, others, and yourself in the gym. Everybody's there for the same reason, and nobody wants to be distracted or held up. Do yourself and others a favor, and follow this simple, easy, and the most part, downright obvious rules. Here are seven basic gym etiquettes to follow. One. Read, understand, and follow all rules, expectations, and posted signs. Observe all posted equipment, instructions, and warnings. If there is a piece of equipment you do not know how to use, don't assume you know how to use it, and ask for assistance. 2. Ask if you could work in between sets. If they say no, please be patient and wait. When working in, allow the other person to use the equipment after each set and reset all equipment adjustments back to where they were before you started. You can claim a piece of equipment by setting a towel or water bottle on it or next to it. Three. Allow others to work in between your sets. Do not rest on the equipment. It is better to walk around to accelerate your recovery. When using a cardio equipment, please do not exceed the 45 minute time limit. Wipe down all equipment following each set with the provided pre-moistened wipes, then discard the wipes appropriately. When done, with a piece of equipment, wipe down the equipment with the provided pre-moistened wipes, then discard the wipes appropriately. Take all extra personal equipment with you, includes water bottle, towels, weigh belts, etc. Put all equipment away. Rack free weights in their designated location. Return cable accessories to the stand, dumbbells and kettlebells, jump ropes, and stretch cords. Return to the appropriate rack, stability balls, balance balls, and foam rollers are to be wiped down, then return to the storage area. 4. Stay clear of free weight areas when in use. Do not exercise in walking areas, gray floor pathways, and in front of water fountains, water and ice machines, wall-mounted wipe containers, and trash recycle receptacles. Do not stand in front of a dumbbell rack. Before using a wall-mounted mirror, look around to make sure you are not in someone else's space. 5. Keep in mind that this is a public place. Avoid excess chatter while in the exercise areas. Limit cell phone use that stops you from exercising. Limit grunting and yelling during exercise. The use of profanity while exercising is not acceptable. Avoid dropping weights. Avoid banging weights stacked on the machines. Use cardio equipment properly. Do not bounce balls in the facility. Basketball are for the basketball courts. Remember that loud or constant noises can annoy other facility users. 6. Wear workout clothes and athletic shoes in the exercise area. Jeans are not appropriate. Refrain from working out without a shirt or in just a sports bra and athletic shoes. 7. Avoid offensive body odors, bath 
regularly and use deodorant. Wipe down equipment after use. Reduce spreading of germs. Wash hands after using the restroom. Wash hands after sneezing or coughing into your hand. Wash hands after your workout. This is a smoke-free facility. Refrain from smoking near the facility entrance. That's the bell, and those are the seven basic gym etiquettes. Before we end, let's have a summary of what we have discussed. That is all and we are done for our class. But don't forget to click like, share, leave a comment, and subscribe to Buhay Maestra. Bye!